what's up guys how you guys doing today so today guys don't be ready to be different have some fun and be yourself guys but today is currently saturday and it has been so long since i have recorded a video it has been around over two weeks and i went to ottawa and this is what this video is revolving around my ottawa trip um and i also have some um, footage from St. Andrews College but I don't have it on me it's at school so that'll be next week's video St. Andrews College but it was so much fun I have so many pictures and I it, it's so I'll just put that in the video but it is gloomy outside today and yeah so it's just gloomy but I have to talk to you guys about why I didn't like upload a, a video, any video last week. So it's been two weeks since I've recorded. Basically, the main reason is um, I was gone um, to Tuesday. So it was March break. The March break, it was March break was over. I recorded all the March break. You guys know that. But then the Monday I went back to school and it was just a regular school day, I was in record. And then Tuesday, I went to St. Andrews College, I recorded stuff there, but I did not have that footage on me. Um, it is at school, like I said. And, um, and then, uh, Tuesday was so much fun. We did, we were performing at St. Andrews College for this thing called the Sacred Canoe. It is, um, it is all about like the indigenous peoples and about giving reconciliation towards them for like the residential school and what we as a country and as like a community has done to the First Nations people and the indigenous people. So that's what it was all about. It was about raising, uh, raising uh, um, awareness for them. So it was really, really good. It was really, really interesting. There was um, indigenous people there leading acts and it, it was it was so good. And then uh, um, the next day, which was Wednesday, so I got back in my house on Tuesday at like 10 and I had to pack or well, finish packing for Wednesday, which was we were going to Ottawa and this thing, the sacred canoe was being, was being taken to Ottawa and it, Ottawa was so much fun I didn't record a lot because um, it was mainly for the experience and all that and um, I might the we the Vaughn Film Festival came with us so I might be able to take some footage from their video I don't know if they have it up yet but I'll try I'll try to get the most amount of footage I can but um, it was just such a fun trip. So the first day we arrived, uh, which was Wednesday, we arrived there at like three, around four, it was more three thirty four ish And um, we went, we were arrived in Ottawa, but then we went over, over the, over a bridge to Gatineau, Quebec. And we went to a museum, which the museum was so much fun. And uh, then we, after the museum, we went to the Rideau Center for dinner. And the Rideau Center is like the biggest mall in Ottawa, I believe. It could be even the biggest mall in Canada. I don't know. It was, it was a huge mall. It was a big deal. It was so much fun there as well. And as long, we were playing a game in the bus called name that monument it was so much fun and we also had bus karaoke it was just this trip was so much fun and then later that night we came back to the hotel at like around eight and we we there was four people in my room and we stayed up until like 3 a.m that the the like that day so it was like we went to bed at 3 a.m. on Thursday, and on Thursday we had to wake up at 7 a.m., have breakfast, and be downstairs in the lobby at 8.45 so that we could get on the bus and go to Parliament for 9 o'clock. 
and we were presenting the sacred canoe to the uh, to Parliament to uh, we invited Justin Trudeau but he wasn't around and our MP Kyle Peterson he came and same with um, Robert Oulette Falcon Falcon and he, they were just very interesting people to get to know and then there were some indigenous people of Ottawa there accepting our our canoe and spiritually because they gave it back to us but back to the morning so we we didn't go to bed until 3 a.m. like I said and we there was a phone and we we were getting the phone call at 7 a.m. and it hit so fast and then we had to go down breakfast was at 7 30 we had to go down at 7 30 have breakfast and we were not awake at all and this is where i like this is where i had to start to get the problem of like i wasn't feeling like when i came back from ottawa this is why i wasn't able to upload a video so then we went to parliament and we got to meet all these people like do all these dances and songs and everything. it was so much fun and then after parliament we went to another museum it was the art gallery of ottawa and it was such a really cool art gallery it was so much fun there you could see the parliament buildings out of the window here's a picture of that and it was just such a very fun time at parliament and at that mu at the art gallery and then we went to um i forget what it's called but it was like this outdoor mall where there's like this outdoor strip and um we had dinner there we had dinner at an old style diner and then we were done that we were done at like seven that was like our meetup time and then we went bowling until like 9 30 so it was we arrived at bowling at like 7 30 and then we went to 9 30 and the bowling was so much fun and then again we got back to the hotel at 10 and we never ended up going to sleep until 2 30 the next morning so this is now friday morning and again we had to be up at 7 a.m at this point i was so tired i was exhausted I had a coffee at the hotel and then we stopped at an en route. Um, well, before that, we had to meet um, up, like, uh, I believe it was 8.45 again, 8.30, something like that. And some people didn't even wake up until like 8.30, so this was like our last thing. And we canceled a couple of things in that day. We were just going to go to another museum. But we had a semi-formal that night, and it wasn't a big deal even though I was involved in the semi-formal, like I'm on student council, and we were involved in semi-formal. It wasn't a big deal, I was going to get there no matter what, but some people were complaining and their parents called, and we ended up just not doing anything on Friday. So we got on the bus, and then we went, we traveled to an en route. And what an en route is, you, if you're from the U.S. or any other place in the world, you do not have these en routes. They stop. Um, I remember we usually, we go to Buffalo, and they stop going past the, like, you, you don't get them in Buffalo anymore. So, you, yeah. But we stopped in this place, and uh, I went to Tim Hortons, and I just got a sandwich and a donut, but I got an iced coffee. I was so tired at this point. And I was getting to this point where I was like, I'm congested and I'm starting to feel sick. And then we arrived. After about six hours drive, we arrived back in at, at my school. And it was like 2.15 and we just unloaded the bus. And then I came home and I had to get ready for Semi. And Semi was at 6.00. It started at 6.30, I believe, 6 or 6.30, but I had to be there at like 5 so I could set everything up. I was taking pictures to the yearbook, but 
I was involved with student council, so I had to be there. It was our event, and uh, uh, it was it was very good. Semi was very very good. We were dancing, we were partying, we were doing everything. But I was still feeling tired. But I was beyond that. I was just trying to have a fun time, and uh, the sit like. Then semi was over at like ten, but I had to stay up. I had to stay over and help. And by the time all that was over, we got back at like twelve. And by that time, I haven't slept. The max I've slept is like I don't even know, like seven hours, something like that. What was it? Like around seven hours. That was the max I've slept in the past like two days. I was so tired and I slept until the next morning which is Saturday I slept until that morning um, until like 11 30 12 o'clock and at that point I was just so sick and I went to work that later that day and I was like I don't feel well enough to record a vlog and just record anything so I would never end up posting a vlog that weekend and now here we are that is why I never posted a video for that but the Ottawa trip was so much fun it is now the next morning and um, I went to work last night and it was work was good but um it was snowing and it is currently like the last day of March it is March 31st and this is what it looks outside right now like we have snow like straight up snow and trees are covered and everything like oh my gosh I don't why does why do we have to get snow? But um yeah, so I'm going to now show you the footage and photos from Ottawa. It is the morning of going to Ottawa. Last night was so much fun at the Sacred Canoe at St. Andrews College. But we are currently now just getting ready to go to Ottawa while I am. It is 7.04 and we are planning on leaving at 7.15 so I have to be downstairs and put my suitcase down in a couple minutes. But uh, I'm ready for Ottawa. I'm ready to leave for Ottawa. So I will see you guys in Ottawa. such a fun trip guys it was so much fun but um it is currently now 336 and i have to start getting ready for semi because semi is at 630 today and 
I have to be there around 5 because I'm helping out. I'm on student council and it's our event. So I have to get ready for that. But Audible was so much fun. It was such a fun trip. It was like, um, like a very fun trip. It was a school trip, but it didn't feel like a school trip. But Audible was just a very fun time. So I'm going to get ready for semi. Yeah, Ottawa was very, very fun. I hope you guys did enjoy that. Um, I didn't record a lot, honestly. I did take some photos, but it was more about, like, being there with my friends and being there with the canoe and reconciling about um, the sacred canoe and about the indigenous people and what they had to go through. Yeah, so... Um, it's almost 11 o'clock on uh, Sunday, and it's not a, I don't know, it's not, it's not a lovely day outside. Tomorrow is April, and we have snow. Yesterday was a gloomy day, but like, at least there wasn't any snow. I don't know, it's not good, it's not fun, but hopefully John and I are able to go outside today and see if we can go in the snow. Um, if we have snow on our driveway... I want to see if I'm going to go in net, but I don't think there's a, like a lot of snow in the driveway. Although, you never know. Um, yeah, so, um, yeah, I don't know. I'm just going to, I don't know. I'm just going to do something. Alright guys, so that is going to have to end off today's video. So I'd basically like to thank you guys so much for watching. I do hope you guys enjoyed. And if you like to watch another video guys, be subscribed to my YouTube channel, turn on my post notifications, and smash that like button. Smash. Stay savage minds. Peace out. I will see you guys in tomorrow's video.